What's up guys, it's me Bradley from Bradley's Adventures and we're back out here in the woods. So I was going to plan on doing herping. I started recording a herping video and turns out that there was no animals out here today. So that we aren't going to upload, but instead we're going to do a video, what's in my herping bag. First off, if none of you know what herping is, herping is basically the search of reptiles and amphibians. So basically that's it. So I'll go ahead and show you guys what is in my herping video. I'll say some things that about what I would like to be in my herping um, bag, but we'll go ahead and start with this front pocket. So I have some cotton balls. This first pocket is basically my first aid kit. So I have some cotton balls. Then I have some lavender essential oil because if you put lavender on a cotton ball and then you go ahead and band-aid it together, it's, it's really good for bee stings. So I have both of those together. Uh, you probably already guessed I do have band-aids. I have a washcloth just for if you're bleeding or something you have to dry it up and then I have some hydrogen peroxide in a little squirt bottle for if you have a wound or something like old cut clean it you would clean it it would foam because that's what hydrogen peroxide does to clean it, it foams. And then you take your towel and you dry it. Now I always clean the towels after using them. Okay, so that is the first pocket. I'm making sure I ain't forgetting anything. Okay, so first pocket, it's not a lot. What I'd like is, I'd like um, way more better things like actual like stitch ring uh like a stitch ring kit or different things like that that would be really nice to have so we'll go ahead and move to the next pocket okay next pocket is this little pocket i don't even know if i have anything in it okay i actually don't right now but i typically keep a pocket knife and a lighter in here in case if i get lost okay next pocket this one is a medium sized pocket. I keep this with a little bit of water because this I use for if there's a really dry frog or something, I'll just go ahead and douse him down. That way he gets nice and moisturized. One second guys, we just had a little problem with the stand and then here I have just a little bit of potting soil. You never know when you might need potting soil, but I have it just in case. Um, and then here's our next thing. We have a pillowcase, and the reason I have these pillowcases are in case if there's a snake or something that you have to relocate, you pick them up, then you put them in here because it's basically breathable like a snake bag. You can buy snake bags, but I just ain't gonna. So I have a bigger and a smaller pillowcase in that pocket. We'll go ahead and move to the next pocket. I also wanna say guys, I am sorry for no video for the past three weeks. Um, my tablet that I actually recorded my videos on actually broke the charging bit vid so I'm using my brother's tablet so until I can get a better camera so that's the situation with that okay guys our last and final pocket which actually doesn't hold a lot if I was herping I'd probably have my camera back here if I'd record herping but I have a flashlight in case if it's dark. It's actually out of batteries right now, so I gotta change that because it's not turned on. 
Then I have a notebook and a pen. With God, all things are possible. So I go ahead and have this notebook because let's say we found a toad, I'd write down what type of toad it was. That way I can just keep a nice journal of what I caught that day, say what day it is. And actually that's what's in that pack. I typically have a container out in here, but I actually used it the other day to house my salamander. Ooh, little sneak peek. We'll go ahead and do a video on that guy soon. His name is Sal, Salamander. So, next thing, no matter if it's hot or cold out, you always want water while you're herping. I might have went a little over much on water, but water is good. It's always nice to have water. So, that's about everything in my pack. I'd like to have way more things for my pack. Um, it might not look like a lot, but um, typically you should have a phone. I'm not old enough to have a phone yet, but I have my tablet on me when I'm herping. So that's what's in that pack. Okay guys, the verse of the day is Matthew 19, 26. But Jesus beheld them and said unto them, With men this is impossible. But with God, all things are possible. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and comment and subscribe. Um, if you guys have ever gone herping, go ahead and let me down, know down in the description. Um, let me know what you caught. Uh, bye.